Hey everybody, so I want to talk about a fairly alarming issue I'm having in my fully electric car now that we're deep into the Colorado winter. So most folks know at this point that the range on EVs decrease when the temperatures go down, but performance also tends to decrease to varying degrees. Now this is different than an internal combustion car where sure performance may vary depending on temperature, but my mini electric car, well, uh, check this out. We're seeing some pretty uh, alarming performance decreases when the temperature gets really low. All right, so here's my 2022 Mini Cooper SE. It has been sitting outside here in Colorado during a cold streak. And it's been outside all night. Let's see what the temperature is. We actually hit sub-zero last night, currently sitting at four degrees Fahrenheit. And here is the issue. Look at these bars go down. This is actually the acceleration meter on the mini. And these little clicks mean how much acceleration you have available. When it's at a hundred percent, you get the full enchilada. You get all the beans. However, when the battery is very low or if it's very cold, you'll actually lose clicks as the car derates itself. And it's derated itself so much when we're not even at 50% of its capability, but closer to what? 30, 35% of its capability. So let's see what that means in terms of acceleration. All right, so here we go. Just pulled out onto the main road from the office, hit a red light, and I'm gonna go full throttle and see how quickly this car accelerates. So when the light turns green, full throttle, there we go. A little bit of traction control intervention, but now we've got full traction and you can see 30, 35, 40 miles an hour there. It is incredible incredibly slow when it gets cold. So what we're gonna do is we actually have a, um, uh, a highway coming up where I have to merge onto to get to my next destination. And we're gonna see can the Mini comfortably do highway speeds. Now we got a merge here, so I'm gonna be pretty careful with making sure I have enough space to accelerate out into traffic here. And let's see what happens. Okay, here we go. Come on, full throttle, that's all she's got. 30 miles an hour, traffic's coming up. 40, 45, can we make it up the hill even? 50, 52, 55, okay, so we were able to get to 55 miles an hour. Now in theory, as I start driving this car, as some of those electrons leave the battery, we should be putting uh, more heat into the pack and we should be seeing these bars increase. Now, I don't wanna say that I feel like I'm a road hazard right now. The car will still accelerate faster than some older cars I have, but certainly you gotta be prepared for these cold weather um, situations to, uh, to leave some extra room when it comes to merging and certainly passing I wouldn't want to try to zip out in front of traffic in this situation all right so a quick status update so I've been driving around doing some chores here in the town we're down to 65% state of charge so we used what 30% of the battery went from like 90 ish down to 65 and the percentage of power available the percentage of e power is 60% so we went from 30% to 50 and now we're at 60 now around town the car still feels pretty zippy it's just when you're really trying to uh, get ahead of someone where you notice a lack of power certainly not at a dangerous level right now but it's still frustrating even after 30 minutes of driving I still only have 65% of this vehicle's performance I want more come on mini let's get that cold weather performance doing a little bit better let me know what you guys think in the comment section below just a quick little update of how it's going with the mini.